up in 654. You're watching A Morning for a Tuesday. And it's a pleasure to welcome to our studio John Gogo and Mike Walsh. Now, these two gentlemen are involved in a really interesting presentation called Dry Wit. And it takes place on uh, Friday at McPherson Playhouse, right across the street. Mike, let's talk first of all about why you're organizing this event. It is really an awareness event for uh, both mental health and addiction. It is, yep. Um, basically what I wanted to do was I wanted to bring uh, 25 local addiction, mental health and community resource organizations together under one roof and just uh, open it up to the public to come in, uh, people in recovery, people contemplating recovery, people just looking for information on the resources available in Victoria and also kind of a networking uh, type event where uh, workers and volunteers from the, uh, the field can come and just check out what's going on and the other half of the event um, I just wanted people to kind of leave their lives behind and come out for an hour and a half of entertainment including John Gogo and a bunch of other um, awesome performers and, and just sort of have a good night and it's the first time that uh, this kind of event has been going on in, uh, in, in Victoria that I'm aware of. John Gogo you're one of the performers what can we expect to see from you? Uh, I think I'm up there for about 20 minutes or something like that. I think so, yeah. And uh, I haven't decided what to do yet. Sometimes Play the guitar and sing. Yeah. That's what I'm going to do. <laughs> that's, that's a good start always. Uh, you have some other performers there as well and a real mixture of talent. Yes, so uh, we have uh, magician uh, Shane King, uh, John Gogo, a very bizarre and peculiar um, um, uh, stand-up comic from the UK, Ray Parker. Uh, we have Nikki Deanne, who is a local cabaret singer. And um, the um, Cheesecake Burlesque Review Show. And there's one other. Um, I'm sorry. <laughs> Should be a lot of fun, though. So tickets are $19, but you're giving a lot of the tickets away. We are, yeah. 75% of the tickets at least will be given away. Uh, there's still some tickets for sale right now through the McPherson box office. Tickets are $19. So whatever is sold um, in the next few days, we'll be able to gift out more tickets to uh, people that are in recovery or who can't afford to go. You're in recovery. I am. And you started, uh, well, you, you started the Victoria chapter of Life Ring Secular Recovery. Can you tell me about that group? Sure. So Life Ring is out of, uh, based out of Oakland, California. It's a solution-focused, self-help, peer support, uh, secular recovery group for people that have addictions to alcohol and drugs. I would say that it's an alternative to other programs that are, uh, say, faith-based, 12-step uh, programs. It's a secular environment, so people can be any faith they want. We just don't discuss it at the meetings. All right, so if people want to find out more information about mental health and addiction, they can attend Dry Wit. All that information will be there. But at the same time, if you just want to go and have a great time, check it out. It's coming up this Friday at McPherson Playhouse right across the street from us here. Uh, on Pandora Avenue and you'll see John Gogo which is always worth the price of admission and uh, enjoy some other great talent as well and you can get more information uh, about your group at unhooked.ca is that right? Uh, dot com. Dot com. Unhooked.com and I'll be the MC, and I'm a budding comedian and I've been wanting to get up on stage and say some silly things for a while so hopefully that'll work out well. John Gogo thank you so much, Mike Walsh as well Pleasure. and uh, we'll see you on Friday. Again tickets available right now at McPherson Box Office and they're just $19. This is A Morning. Stay with us.